Hey there, everyone. This is Rao Cal playing Keen One. It's it's Commander Keen. It's the first one. In case you were confused, made in January. If I forgot the date, even though it was just written there. We know we know the drill, and we continue our game. File three. I still have just like one zero life. I got a few attempts to do. And the way I understand it, afterwards I'm going to do Super City Alpha there, and that might be where there be some sort of maybe secret thing that I might miss, and that is no pressure. Oh my god. Okay, why am I doing this? Why am I doing this, Mr. Ring? Go away, clam guy! Well, I, okay, well that wasn't that bad. This is scary. We're in the greatest depths of hell, and I go ahead and die, because jumping, jumping is hard. Jumping is R. Ish. Jumping is R. It's a very, very well known deity of uh, ancient India. And uh, remember that. Okay, so let's try and do this again. This time with more success stories, if possible. Urgh! You see, that was the most success story ever. So let's just ignore that little box there that exists for reasons unknown. Not too sure why you would want to go on that little box. That little box is just asking for trouble, if I do say so myself. Now it'd be nice if I could have enough scourge to gain myself an extra life and thus have some sort of life insurance. Can I fall down there? I don't know. <laughs> that is a knowledge I do not possess. That is filling me with fright. Okay, this goes back down to... Whoa! <laughs> this is a clam guy police temple. I did not expect that. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and save just in just in case I'm pressing a key because maybe this will be okay. So I I, I have heard that them little robots buddies there. Yeah, they do not hurt me. They merely push me around. If I were to do a meta something awful joke, I would call them a certain sort of robot. Except I, I forgot. No. Okay, so they don't, can't even squish me against a wall. Like, walls! They, they don't believe in wall. Like, robots need to adhere to very strict theosophy. And, uh, in, in, in their system of beliefs, walls just don't have any authority. I know it's kind of sad, and I mean, we look at it, yeah, I want a free life, that's, that is filling me with happiness. And I mean, I know we, we, we look at that and we're like, come on, th that it's monstrous not to give walls rights and whatever, cars and free garages and everything, but you need to understand that this was back in, you know, 1990s, that was another time. Back then, it, things were all cats. And that's just... Oh my god, you're scary. Okay, how, many, how much guns do I have? I have nine charges. I have nine charges? Can I... Hua! Oh, he has met the fate of, of fire. You, you, you're dumb. And you're kind of walking around, and, and, and your legs are not moving in a fashion which would logically permit some sort of motion. Thusly, you shall explode in a streaming fireball of logic, because I said so. Okay, so this looks like it's gonna be annoying. Um, I'm actually going to restart that one. Title. I know, I know, my cow, whatever, because, oh no, no freaking god, ah, this is going in places that are not comfortable, okay, continue game, because I don't want to waste a life there, because I just want a life there, so you get to see me do this part again, it's, it's by far the most exhilarating segment, of the level, so I mean, I think this really should be constituted the bonus. I mean, there, there, there are a billion people living in underdeveloped countries that would just kill in order to have frontal appendages that enable them to lift themselves up from the ground if they fell, but instead they just have to kind of crawl everywhere 
and hope for the best. And the fact that some of you guys can't accept that, it just disgusts me right out of here. That I, I become all filled with slime for some reason, and people stop confusing me with an apple, because apples are probably one of nature's least slimiest things. And that includes everything, including rocks and stuff, because sometimes these fellas have moss on them. So, instead of doing it the stupid way, I'm going to do it the smart way, which is to say, defying the laws of physics and common sense, and go and talk to this guy. The Yorpish Whisper say, look for darkened bricks. You can see not but their upper left corner. So, I understand that the secret passage, which becomes me somewhere, is hidden in the shadows, as was suggested to me by something else, and also something else. Probably should have saved before, but now I must live with my mistakes. There's a whole bunch of guns here. It's freaking Arkansas. Uh, considering everything is made of meatloaf, I guess that's understandable. No!